Hi everyone, first and foremost, I apologize for the low light, the sound quality, and the my voice because I just, I can't, I've been losing it off and on. But I wanted to share um, a couple of the license plates that I've made. Uh, this one's for my husband. And what I started out with is gray cardstock. I find that the gray really is um, neutral enough where any distressing that's done, it, um, I have to use a lot less ink to distress it. Uh, in other words, it already starts off being gray distress. So this is one I did for my husband yesterday. And um, he's, I guess, manly enough where he loves purple and pink. So I have some pink and purple glimmer mist. Um, I used um, uh, old paper uh, for the edging. And this is doubled up, so there's two cardstocks. I cut them out, and it's distressed with um, this tool. On the edges so today I was thinking you know I really like uh, the background but I want something else so uh, my parents anniversary is coming up and I made one for them right here and the text in the background I'm sorry cannot focus for some reason um, this is printed off on white cardstock but the um, I ran the page through my printer with Russian text on it. My family's Russian. Um, and it's in particular about the city that we lived in, in Odessa on the Black Sea. So I have that on white cardstock, printed on white cardstock in gray ink, printed out in the background. So it already has a background. So it's um, their anniversary. So I'm going to put a little plus sign or and, and percent between their names. So this is what it looks like when I print it off on white cardstock with gray text, the Russian text. But you can do this technique with anything. French script, um, you could do hand or in script, you could do um, Japanese text and maybe run it through Kettlebug with some of those Asian folders. And I made one for my sister and it's super shimmery. Can you see that? Um, she loves blues and green, so I have um, a couple of different glimmer mists that I used on hers, including um, Glacier, and I topped everything off with Pearl. So that's hers. looks fabulous. And then I made one for myself in purple, because that's my favorite color. And because I have so many A's in my name, and... I would have run out with any one set. All I ended up doing is using three different sets of um, letter stamps um, to make sure that I had enough of the letters. Especially my parents have some, you know, both A's, and you know, I had loads of A's. So what I used is um, Ink and Ink Oh, I don't know what this one is called. City Q, no, Curly Q alphabet, um, in addition to the um, Heidi um, Swaps alphabet, um, just clear stamps. This is in the markdown aisle. Um, and some letters from the Stampology license plate kit. And worked out really nicely. And actually for my parents, what I'm going to do is, um, there's some dates, uh, months and dates, and some numbers. I'm going to cut one of the older dates, the 2004, and put their anniversary month and this year in the two stamps for the expiration dates and bling it out. So I'll show you the final one for theirs, but these are the ones that are completed. So it's mine. Super shimmery. Love it my sister's, and my husband's. And since I have one blank left, I cut a whole bunch of them um, with the Russian text in the background. I'm going to make one for um, our niece Amanda. Um, hope you enjoy, and if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them after the, um, the video. Thanks for watching.